What's up everyone, Giant Opinion, some breaking MLB news, more from the San Francisco Giants. They are re-signing Alex Wood to a two-year, $10 million deal, $5 million annually, and this is another one of the better starting pitchers off the market. Uh, this past season, Alex Wood had an ERA of 3.83, and while that's not elite by any means, he was our number five starter pretty much. That's pretty good for a number five starter. It's really good actually. His FIP was around 3.63, and uh, he gave up less hits than innings pitched. So he doesn't really have the filthiest pitches, but he's a guy who will pitch to ground ball contact. Now, that can be pretty valuable when you have a good defensive infield, which the Giants do. And he's a left-handed pitcher too, which just gives him a little bit more value. Obviously, it didn't work out necessarily in Atlanta for too long. Uh, he went, went over to the Dodgers, had an all-star season in 2017, very good. Cincinnati Reds didn't work, went back to L.A., came, back, came to the Giants this past season, and was a very key contributor for this team. 26 starts, he could provide some innings. Now, he missed a few starts here and there, <laughs> okay, but we're paying him $5 million annually. <laughs> That's a pretty good value deal, in my opinion. He already knows the coaching staff. The team knows him. Farhan Zaidi knows him. Scott Harris knows him. We know what he can be. We just want him to, to kind of perform the same way he did last season. We're not asking him to pitch um, nine innings and shut out teams. No. If he gives up two rounds a start, whatever. That's really not that bad. That's pretty good, actually, for the fifth starter in the rotation. And $5 million, I like this deal a lot. It's just my opinion, though. But let me know what you guys think. I'm curious to hear. also made a video about Anthony DiSclefani, so let me know. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you all in the next one. Peace.